I don't know about you, but I love favorites videos on YouTube. I love to watch favorites videos, which I think is really fun. I have been enjoying some amazing products, beauty products, makeup, fragrances in the month of February. Now we're well into March, so I'm a little late doing my February favorites. So this is kind of current favorites slash February favorites. So let's jump in. Hi my lovely people, welcome back to another fabulous beauty video. In this video I'm going to share with you some amazing stuff I've been enjoying, you know, actually still, but mostly in the month of February I discovered some really amazing products in February and I've been loving them since. As always, I think I'm going to start with fragrances. I have been loving a few fragrances lately. Um, they're kind of like almost to me transitional fragrances which by the way stay tuned for my transitional fragrances to ease into spring. I have a 400 plus fragrance collection with all sorts of niche fragrances you guys. I have so many niche fragrances. In my you know massive collection with designer and niche this stands out. I mean, there is something so amazing about this fragrance. This, you guys, smells absolutely like a goddess. I know I use that word way too much because with, with the few of the fragrances in my collection that I absolutely go nuts for, this right here, this is a fresh floral fragrance, but you guys don't take it at that face value. This makes you feel like you are this high-class, fashionable woman. You're this globetrotter. You just are always impeccably dressed, you know? Just like an elegant, gorgeous, goddess-looking woman. That's really what comes to my mind. This smells absolutely gorgeous. And by the way, I talk to death about this fragrance on my channel. Seriously, I'm not even sponsored or I don't even have any affiliation at all with uh, Dior. But, you know, let me show you. I don't know if you can tell, the, the juice is actually like milk. It, it looks like milk. It's like a milky juice. I don't know if you if the camera ca captured that. Oh, you guys, this makes me smell absolutely fantastic. I get so many compliments. It has that beautiful, like, gorgeous woman scent, you know? This has loads of beautiful white florals like magnolia, jasmine, name it, it's like, gorgeous bouquet of white florals with a little hint of green which always oh I love that hint of green like it always makes fragrances amazing um, so this is actually alcohol free and I feel like because it's alcohol free this fragrance lasts a long time on my skin it really is like wearing a perfume oil almost it just just absolutely stunning it just you know, stays on top of your skin and like just radiates from you all day. And especially, oh my gosh, here, let me get to that. Oh, I didn't, I didn't talk about this one. This one is, again, I don't need to go into notes and accords or anything. This is Enfonistome of the Dior the, uh, Jadon the, uh, fragrance line. This one also is a kind of floral fragrance. This has the most beautiful floral fragrance notes like Lily of the Valley, Tuberose, uh, Jasmine, Ylang Ylang, Rose. Absolutely beautiful. It opens with this juicy blood orange note that's so to die for and you can really smell that very sensual sandalwood dry down you guys absolutely beautiful love these two and i was talking about how these two have been absolutely loving layering these two with these two. Oh my gosh you guys i just sort of accidentally stumbled upon these two at macy's when i was shopping for fragrances Ah, you know, this, I had to have it the moment I saw that. This is, you guys, the uh, Jodo, um, I think, um, like, this is a, a general body scrub and body gel here. I will talk to you in a minute. For the entire Jodo line, okay? This one right here, you guys, is a body scrub, and it smells 
has that Jadah DNA and it works with both of these. It'll work with any of the Jadah line um, fragrances. And this has, this actually is a really good scrub. It actually scrubs really well. It's a sugar scrub and it has like really nourishing oils in it. And it has this little micro specks of uh, micro shimmer. Okay, it looks absolutely gorgeous. I, when I scrub with this, my skin becomes so soft and it glows from the oils. What you can do is you can like soap your body, you know, in the shower, you soap yourself, you rinse out and then you scrub with this. And then after scrubbing, just dust off everything and you have like this beautiful shimmer. By the way, you can't really see it on this camera. I've actually done videos about this before or featuring this anyway and I've put like close-ups of it. I'll try to reinsert them here. But yeah, they're so, it smells so good, you guys. It smells absolutely like fabulous, high class, sophisticated, rich, sexy goddess like woman you know it's absolutely i don't know how to describe it you really have to smell it yourself i will not be able to describe it and do it justice but anyway oh so good i absolutely have been enjoying so much this combination so there's that scrub right here it does a really good job by the way and then we have this right here. Oh my God, it's not gorgeous. I love these uh, beautiful, like round, soft touch um, jars. Anyway, this is the body gel with that micro shimmer in it. You guys, ooh, this looks so, so good. So, so good on the skin. So I'm gonna take a little bit of this and put it on top of here. Um, this is a moisturizing gel. So it's like a moisturizer, but like the gel form and it has loads of micro uh, shimmer in it that catches the light. Oh my God, especially in springtime, wearing this out and about, like you're gonna just shimmer and glow like a goddess and smell like a goddess. So I don't know if you can see, you probably can't because this camera doesn't capture. You have to see it in the sunlight or real daylight in the real life. This in real life, you guys, it shimmers. Like you don't have to get close to see it. I mean, you can see your your body just shimmering, okay? Absolutely beautiful. Actually, the sales associate was wearing this when I bought it and she said that she wore, like put it on like 6 a.m. in the morning and it was like very late at night, like eight o'clock at night or something. And it was still there just shimmering away on her body. So these glitter, like these micro shimmers don't fall off that easy. They don't rub off that easy. Like they stay. They stay for a long time. And someone asked me how long this the scent lasts. Forever. Seriously, you guys. These two, both the scrub and these two, the scent in this is very strong actually. So layering these two with these two, like the fragrance lasts 12 plus hours and it goes on and on and on and if you didn't wear let's say the fragrances on top and you just wore the micro shimmer the the, the i'm sorry just wore the the moisturizing gel with the micro shimmer that scent scent lasts for all day too like an eight hour day absolutely like long lasting and they are a little pricey but i'm telling you they are worth every penny then I found some gems in terms of body care too. I just talked about this in my previous video too, my layering combo video I just uploaded. This is the Laura Mercier Ampre Vini body cream and it's just absolutely delicious. This smells like a very delicious creamy milky vanilla dessert. Yeah, this smells like a creamy like souffle or something like it's just oh so moisturizing and it's so soothing very hydrating you know do you see that like my just hand looks just so like a bucket of water yeah this is one of those body creams that you when you rub it on it feels like somebody just threw a bucket of water on your skin like if it feels dehydrated especially you know in the winter time absolutely gorgeous i've been loving layering fragrances with that it's delicious smelling and another vanilla body cream i've absolutely been loving is the fenty butter drop in the vanilla scent 
Oh, this is the limited edition one, and I believe it's only now available. No, it's available on Sephora too, but it keeps selling out. I'll link both down in the description box for you. I think it's available on Fenty too and a few other retailers. I'll link all of it down in the description box for you. Always check my description box for like best prices and best places to buy products. So this is what it looks like. This is, as you know, her butter drops are like whipped you know whipped oils so they like really go on like an oil when you put it on it just is so good like look at that you guys and these are amazing for layering with fragrances because it almost works like a hybrid like cream oil hybrid and uh an oil in my opinion you guys um layer better with fragrances than even cream so this is like that whipped oil consistency which is perfect for layering i've been loving layering this with my note my uh saint uh bath what do you call it uh venevis indies kali all my vanilla fragrances i have been loving layering that with both of this Laura Mercier and the Fenty one. I have a few other body products. I've just been loving body products lately, like loving on my body, I guess. Um, so the next one, I really want to talk about this Jasmine Body Oil by Herbivore. This one is so good. Um, I'm like running out of spots on my skin, but that's okay. I'll just put it here again. Um, so it's, a, it's, it's an oil. You know, and if this is, you guys, way better than those nest oils. I'm telling you, this is, the scent in this is much more beautiful and true jasmine-like than the nest jasmine one. This is actually so much better, in my opinion, than less, the nest or body oil. And, you know, better priced, I think, too, by Oberwar. As you can see, I love this thing. I love to layer my jasmine fragrances with this body oil so good um i like to layer that with uh with the gucci gorgeous jasmine it's one that i layer with it i have so many jasmine fragrances you guys so i've been like layering that with so next i have the the, the most gorgeous chocolate combination that i just recently came into uh into like recently but i've been just loving on this you guys this is from a company called mojo spa it's very new to me i had never heard of it before i kind of like accidentally stumbled on it on the internet and they make these amazing body scrubs and body creams i will link it down in the description box um this right here you guys the chocolate truffle body scrub i don't know about truffle but this one smells just like chocolate cake baked chocolate cake okay like a baked chocolate cake it's, it smells exactly like it. it's very chocolatey absolutely delicious and not to mention it really is a good scrub really sloughs off dead skin and really makes your body like polished and shine and here's the posh chocolate cream body cream by lush um this one you guys now this smells like chocolate cake batter okay that smells like chocolate cake after baking it oh this one is like you only need like the slightest little bit and it like lathers up almost like a cream and absolutely gorgeous the scent stays on you and layered with my chocolate fragrances which you know i have a lot of i have the um uh, atelier materi cacao porcelana and i have like the you know like lilac love i have a lot more but anyway i love to layer with them and then the chocolate truffle body lotion is also really good this actually smells kind of like like a chocolate floral um one kind of smells a little bit like a dessert too it's really good as well it's really nice and emollient a very thick this is a very thick cream as you can see it's very rich it's a very thick rich cream um you can see when i put it on the back of my um hand it almost goes on like like tallow you know <laughs> i don't know um very 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 thick it's a very thick one um, and it stays on and just really good. Here, these three right here that I've been loving. The Sol de Janeiro Abam Dia Bright Body Wash. This is a very, this has HA and BHA, um, you know, f what do you call it? Fruit acids in here that really good, it's good for you, you know, sloughing off 
like exfoliating your body like kind of really nice you know ha bhas this smells absolutely delicious like a very delicious addicting smelling fruity body wash so good and this is the matching body scrub which i just used the other day oh man it's so good too and it smells exactly like the body wash i love to use these and use my like fruity ones kind of like this one right here the and the Louisa um, these by the way go really well together and you know and I like to layer that one with this uh, Sol de Janeiro Bomb Dia Bright body cream the matching body cream oh this now that we're like transitioning into uh, springtime I'm moving away from mostly like I mean I still wear it in spring too like the uh, the boom boom cream by sol de janeiro but this you know i pull this out mostly when like spring comes around and throughout summer i wear them too because these aren't like as as thick you know as this is kind of like fruity and juicy okay loving it this i have to talk about you guys this is actually you know i don't want to be the one that advocates for expensive uh, scented water okay so this is actually what I when I first heard about this on YouTube I'm like please give me a break please. people stop talking about things that are just expensive water that you spray on your face that's actually really what I thought it was but I was really intrigued so I still bought it this is the fresh vitamin nectar antioxidant glow water this you guys so comforting and especially now you get into spring and summer especially in a summer hot weather this is gonna come in handy if you're someone who doesn't wear makeup like you can take this in your purse and you can just just spritz yourself watch this okay watch this the mist you see how fine oh that mist is oh this something about this you guys when you spray it on your face you feel like it's like giving you life you know it just there's something you can smell the vitamins in here there are definitely are vitamins in here i like to use this as a base like so i put my um my my skincare on in the morning and then i spritz this on let it you know dry and you know, i'll do my hair while it, it happens and then i put my primer on and then my makeup so it's very refreshing even under makeup and this works as a, a setting spray too which i just did uh, but you know you don't want to use it do that it still seeps into the skin i'm sure but since there's there are vitamins in this you want to kind of do it you know on bare skin but this what i'm definitely going to use more of this summertime when the weather is hot and i let's say i'm out and about and i'm going to just like spritz this all over my face and just Ooh, give my face life i love this thing so much and then i have this i want to talk to you about the chanel la lift cream this is so good i don't know what magic they put in this you know chanel does a lot of like research and you know development they, they do a lot of research and development and they put a lot of work into their uh, skincare even makeup like they do a lot of there's something about this this is very anti-aging you guys it smooths out your skin this has been like my night cream you know lately so i wear this at night time i like to wear more emollient thicker kind of uh creams like this at night time you know it's actually not thick it's actually kind of light you know almost but it, it's very rich you know for you the skin it's very nourishing but also it's actually kind of light you know if you see this it's kind of like a light almost like gel ish but not gel but cream gel to cream kind of formula this is so comfortable on the skin so anti-aging i could see a difference when i started using this cream it really does work you guys it says on chanel website that this makes your skin appear 25 percent smoother and i agree and it says the face facial contours look start to look better and i agree okay this has got like some you know like um compounds in it like i forget what all it is but it really is very anti-aging it's very comforting and soft and absorbent like very very nice yeah. so you guys speaking of chanel you guys know i have been talking to death your ears off about the chanel coco bloom lipsticks especially the two shades that have that metallic kind of sheen that it's got this little very minute specks of shimmer that oh my god they make the lips look so high shine and juicy and 
it's like ruby red and it, it just like catches light and makes you look like so pouty those two shades I love it but guess what you guys I discovered that Chanel Coco Flash lipsticks right here a few of them also have like uh, they come in they're all juicy and absolutely stunning I love them all and I got like six of these by the way just recently and I'm wearing one of them on my lips today look how juicy they look right some of them actually have that sort of slight shimmer too but not metallic shimmer like the coco bloom ones this has got little minute specks of shimmer that catches light and makes your lips look so, so juicy the one i'm wearing has it yeah so this is what i'm wearing this shade is 78 emotion that's what i'm wearing it's kind of like a pinky um rosy shade absolutely gorgeous um let me show you so this is what it looks like do you see that tip like how juicy that tip looks you know and just like let me show you it just makes your lips so juicy absolutely stunning my god i don't know where i have been without discovering the these you know it took me forever now this and this one is 91 boheme now this one doesn't have the little shimmers in it but still is very very juicy and absolutely gorgeous do you see how that just like juicy glim no shim shine on it just makes your lips just so like juicy you know i don't know what else to call it and then this one is 92 amour i think um this one is more like a uh, like a hot hotter pink um let me put that right next to the first shade i mean look at that shine you guys you know do you see that just so good Ugh, where have these been all my life and here's another shade uh, 82 live i believe this is one of them that has the shimmer too so let me now this one is a light rosy color very 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 juicy right there this one um do you see how juicy they look you know just so good i don't know if this camera is doing justice to these shades so good and this one is 60 heat is it beat or heat i can't see uh, this one is a corally kind of shade like a bright coral shade which is perfect for spring and summer right there so some of them have you can see on uh, chanel's website or ulta or wherever ha ha they have these uh, for uh, sale actually here's another one with the shimmers i know this one has shimmers this is 70 attitude so this one is a little bit darker let me put it right here on this end right there that's that one um so yeah you can see i don't know if you can tell the difference probably not in this on this camera but online and actually when you look closer at it you can tell you can see the shimmers so i can see the shimmers in this and i can see that this one doesn't have shimmer i don't know if you can can you guys tell is this thing showing it to you i can't really tell so you can actually tell the difference you can go online too and look at the pictures and you can see the shimmers in some of them i personally prefer the shimmers but a lot of people love these even without the shimmers they're absolutely gorgeous in addition to the um coco bloom lipsticks that have the shimmers that have that metallic juicy pout these are actually coco bloom lipsticks without that you know sort of metallic shimmer but they're still beautiful this is boheme and season um you know these are nice too they're just juicy they just don't have I'm trying to see the difference. So I think Coco Bloom is a little bit thicker and Coco Flash is a little bit more translucent in a way, if that makes sense, you know, more juicy in a, in a kind of natural, more natural, transparent way, whereas Coco Bloom is a little bit more pigmented, if that makes sense. So this is, I think, uh, 126 season, actually. So here's Boheme, which is 130. Um, let me put uh that next to it there it is so these are the coco bloom ones so the coco blooms have uh, the silver band and the sh the coco flash have the gold band so these are the 
the Coco Blooms, these are the Coco Flash. So anyway, even the ones, the Coco Bloom ones without the shimmer, I absolutely adore. I have just been addicted to these, you guys. I have like two drawers full of lipsticks and I'm not even kidding, lipstick, liquid lipsticks and lip glosses. I don't touch any of them lately and this is all I've been wearing and I can't stop. And I already went through a whole tube of my Coco uh, Bloom burst already ran out of it and I have two backups that's how crazy I am about them absolutely gorgeous so last but not least I included this in my last favorite suit too so I'm not gonna stay here the best foundation on earth right here this is the uh, ambient light um, so or sorry ambient soft glow foundation by hourglass that's what I'm wearing right now this is the most flawless foundation that sits like a second skin absolutely blurring and just hides at any imperfections it just you know gives you the most natural but full coverage yet not cakey very light i don't know how they do it i i i've been wearing foundation for so many foundations i have so many in my drawer probably like 50 to 70 foundations i have and this is the best okay take my word for it all right, you guys, that's it. Those are what I have been loving in the month of February. I gotta tell you, I just did a hot new releases video. Check it out. Those fragrances are going to be, some of them anyway, going to be in my March favorites because, you know, I didn't want to include them, although I really am tempted to because, you know, I kind of wore them towards the end of February and the beginning of March, but I still want to, they'll be enjoyed more in March, so they'll be included in the March favorites. I'm telling you, they're absolutely divine. Check that video out if you if you missed it. It's a must watch. Anyway, what do you think about my, my loves, my February favorites? What are your thoughts? Let me know down in the comment section. Do you have any of these fragrances? Do you have any of these body care, skincare, makeup products? What are your thoughts you guys please uh, talk to me you guys haven't been commenting a lot of you are watching videos but you guys are very reluctant to comment which really helps my channel actually it helps with engagement it helps with my my channel growth believe me when i tell you um commenting and you know uh, liking videos and just having a conversation is always great for my channel growth and if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet you've been watching for a while or you're new here just please don't forget to subscribe to my channel down there it's a black button now it used to be red and don't forget to ring the notification bell next to it because otherwise it's really no point in clicking that subscribe button because they're not going to let you know when i upload and don't forget to follow me on instagram and tiktok where i post a lot of fun short content digestible easy content i will see you guys in my next video